Hello. Hello, good morning. Turn right onto Ross oh. Baker Way. We're in then Canada. Alexis is here too. It's Siri. Whatever, she's here. The b is here. Oh, easy. Easy. I'm just kidding. You don't need to talk to her about that. This person gets us places. You like her? Yeah. Do you not? Sketch. Okay. Another foreign country. <laughs> We're here. We made car it. Car driving experience. We're in Canada with our special guest, Clayton, who's joining us. Our special guest. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about. We just landed in Vancouver and it's our first trip to Canada, so we're really excited. A lot of you guys gave us so many good recommendations for like good vegan restaurants and cute areas in Vancouver and stuff, so super excited about that. But first we're headed to Whistler, so we're on our way there now. It's about a two hour drive it looks like, so not bad, I'm gonna experience the Canadian countryside. Yeah, lot to see. Yeah, it's not raining currently. It's just really overcast, but it's really pretty here. So today is actually the inception of an exciting new journey that Clayton is embarking on. Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah, very true. I don't think he's excited. But yesterday, well not yesterday, every day, people ask me if he can post more on his Instagram, like men's style and stuff, because their boyfriends like his style, or they just need more style inspiration for men, or whatever, and everybody asks every day, and the kid does not deliver, so we've Can't had deliver. it. We've yeah. had it up to here with him, and you guys signed a petition by following <laughs> him, basically, and getting him to 4,000 followers, so. Now he has to post on his Instagram every day for a month straight. It starts today, so yeah. Yeah. We're beginning that and I'm really excited about it because he's so cute. And he dresses cute because I dress him. <laughs> I'm a little doll. I'm a doll. <laughs> no, I suggest things. And then he puts his own spin on it, but he's True. so he's so cute and we need to share it with the world, so finally. What do you think of flashing green light? It means go. Oh God. I don't know what it means. It might mean a stop sign. I'm going, I'm I don't know what's going on. Oh God. Okay. Tell them to make room for a real one. Make room for a real one, Canada. <laughs> That's what he says whenever yes, we're driving. Literally, when he has to oh, get no. over or something, mm. he says to the car, make room for a real one. We stopped in at this vegetarian Chinese restaurant that my friend Zoe recommended shout out to you Hello. Zoe shout out to Zoe for requesting I mean referring this place and check it out it's also cute in here look at all these green chairs I like it vacay vibes yeah, vacay vibes <laughs> burnt them off pan fried sticky rice it smells amazing. It also yeah. smells like maple syrup. It does. <laughs> Rate my manner is one to ten. <laughs> Zero is not on the scale. Exactly. <laughs> Are you gonna eat how you actually eat? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not ready to kill the chopster. Pan fried dumplings. Whoa. Make room for a real one. Tell us your thoughts. Really good. Wow. Pan fried dumpling. Oh, lots of Manners are zero. Yep, just like that. A zero. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Clayton, what did we even get? We ordered too much. He tried to warn us. What is this? What did she say? Black tofu dumpling? And what is this? That's a vegetable steam bun. Oh. Looks like those characters. What characters? I don't know. <laughs> okay. These little steam buns we got are so cute. It's like a little pillow. It's so scary. 
Okay guys, we just checked into the hotel. We're at the Fairmont Chateau in Whistler. Eleni's getting ready, because we're gonna go shoot a quick look. Yes. One of the coolest things about Fairmonts is that they use all Le Labo bath products. Oh my God, gold. So pretty, pretty cool. Pretty, pretty much gold. Bars, more bars. But this is the bathroom. So we're staying in the newly renovated Alpine Suites. So this is like the newest room here. They look pretty sweet, nice shower, bathroom. Peace Delaney. Peace Delaney. So it's a suite, so it has like two little rooms. So we have a little couch to lounge on. And then this is like a little living space with a fireplace and a television. So we'll be chilling here, you know, early in the morning, stuff like that. Got cool views of the Rainbow Valley is what the front desk concierge called it. So it's kind of raining today because it's a little bit warmer. Still snow everywhere, real, real pretty. And then this is the sleeping area. We got a king size bed, so Delaney can have a full queen to herself. And I'll get just the edge. I'll get like that part right there. Just kidding. Nice little table here to do work and probably eat maybe if we get some takeout. Another TV in this area and more views. Very cloudy, stormy day, but I'm sure it's gorgeous out there. Can't wait. What do you think? It is so stunning here, and the hotel is really pretty. Yeah. I'll show you guys the lobby and stuff too. Chateau vibes. Chateau, yeah. Chateau Fairmont. So fancy and chic. Yeah. And Whistler. Very lodgy, ski lodge style. I pounce my face. There's people with skis everywhere. Yeah, there sure is. elaine has got her fit on. We're grabbing a little hot chocolate, almond milk hot chocolate, and then we are gonna shoot this look. Is that, that right, D? That's right, see? D, tell the people. What's up, yeah. So I posted my first Instagram photo today, so. You guys are so nice. Thank you for that. I would do both hands, but I'm holding the camera. Thank you for that. Thank you. But yeah, so first day was a success. We're gonna post some additional content right now. And uh, we got some live music cracking behind me right now. Show you a little bit of that. Hopefully you can hear me all right. We just said a couple more tunes, so we're about to get it right now. Make room for a real one. The North Star, no, we're not North Star. <laughs> Sorry, Whistler, the Whistler Village. And uh, what's that? Blackcomb. Oh, Whistler, yeah, Whistler Blackcomb. And we are on our way to Aritzia. Aritzia, Aritzia. Clayton's been calling it Aritzia. We're to gonna look check for some. Out the super puff. Uh, super puff, called? the Mr. Super Puff. Super Puffer or Super Puff? I think it's Super Puff. Everyone highly recommends. Says it works so well. And we're gonna try oh, to find some for earmuffs. Or no? Yeah, I earmuffs. We just had know. Oh yeah, black there it is. That could go with my snow outfit. Okay. All right, we just failed at Aritzia. There was no men's for starters. No men's. Look out, big stairs. They didn't have earmuffs, and I don't think they had the super puff or whatever it's called. Whoa, whoa. I have a blister. Okay, the first dinner of our trip is at Aura at the Nita Lake Lodge, about three miles outside of Whistler Village. And they have a meatless Monday menu, so that's why we're here for show. We get the vegan three courses. House-made bread has arrived with olive oil and balsamic vinegar. Balsamic vinegar here on the side. Make room for a real one. All right, what's the most mannerly thing? We're working on my manners if you weren't here earlier. If you just entered the vlog. Yeah. So. You skipped through. The entire first time being in play. And so, what's the first manly thing to do right now? 
Manners with tea. Now, we're gonna bring the food closer to us. Why is this great? Okay, the, the main goal here is just to get you to choose your mouth closed. Okay. Yeah, that's gonna be happy. That's number one right now? Mouth closed. Maybe a smaller bite would be nice too. Can I see how it's like sticking out of your mouth? Okay, butternut squash risotto. Yum. Toasted hazelnuts on top. Clayton Scott. Cauliflower harissa. Yeah, it's kind of like that. It kind of looks like a cauliflower steak almost with some sweet potatoes. Yams. Or, oh no, yeah, sweet potatoes. Or, no, yams. Yams. Vegan toffee pudding yeah. and ice cream. Wow. Just got back to our room from dinner and the Fairmont left us a little note and some yummy chocolates to cap the night. <laughs> cap the night, huh? <laughs> Look at her. Oh my gosh, what a fit. Yes, girl. Yes. My baby's got her hair done. Oh, makeup, makeup looks beat too. Is that the right terminology? Uh, those are kind yep, of like... Yep, I'm weird. Hooting and hollering. Let's show you the outside. It's gotten a lot clearer out there after this morning snow blizzard. Look at that, look at those mountains. We got the fireplace going. Very nice touch, Fairmont. And we just picked up some... Eco-waste, eco-friendly hotel. Oatmeal, still cut oats. I'm over here getting familiarized with this large mountain. It's huge. Largest ski resort in North America. Don't quote me, but. I just got oat milk hot chocolate. Yeah. What are you wearing? Snow <laughs> Overalls. It's raining. It's raining. We didn't really have a plan going into today and or for this trip in general. We don't like really have a plan. We're kind of just winging it and happy to be in the snow. But today kind of turned into a content day. So you saw we were shooting earlier in the lobby of our hotel. And then after that we went and shot some more in like a wilderness spot and I forgot to like vlog it all so now I just changed one more time and we're gonna go shoot this look before the sun goes down so we're just picking up some lunch right now from a green mustache cafe I think it's called which is supposed to be a good vegan spot so that's what we're doing we're kind of just like on the go and working slash exploring and just taking in the scenery today so we kind of did that so that our day tomorrow can be much freer content wise we won't have to worry about it as much and we might try to go skiing in the morning and then we're gonna go snowmobiling in the afternoon so that that could be fun you know pretty into that it's kind of what's going on what i'm wearing right now this beanie is from urban outfitters just picked it up right before we left i decided i wanted a beanie and I'm wearing the Icon hoodie by Hollister. This jacket is also Hollister. So is this turtleneck. And my mom jeans too are Hollister that you guys can't see really. And my little moon boots. So this is a very cozy, casual winter outfit and I'm here for it. What is this song? That was fans. So as you guys know, Clayton is on the opposite of a social media cleanse. He's on a 30 day Challenge. binge. So we need to get him some content. Cause it's so cute. Look at him, he looks like a little truffle mushroom. So we're gonna shoot some content for him. We just finished mine. I forgot to set up the, the vlog. It's snowing like pretty lightly, but also kind of like Steady. So hopefully you guys can see when I set this up, but I'm gonna show you a little BTS of us getting the shot for the kid. Cause everybody loves the kid.
All right, so we stopped into that vintage shop and I actually found three really good solid pieces. Yes, I love them. Solidness right here. I might wear one. A-okay, -okay. she will probably wear these. I think you can wear them all. Huh? Try on that one at least, for I sure. our last vintage haul, you tried on all my pieces. Oh yeah. In Amsterdam. You guys remember that? Who remembers that? Comment, Raise drop the hand. comment. Raise your hand if you remember that one. That was a good one. I wore some funny stuff. He almost hit his head on the tiny European ceiling. Yeah, we don't have that here. Okay. Okay. That is swag. This is corduroy, fam. <laughs> Peep that cord. Corduroy. <laughs> All right, guys. So, Delaney had a good idea. I'm going to be like the uh, QVC. QVC guy. So, introduce me as your model for the day. This is my model for the day, Delaney. Don't, did I say that right? Yeah. Okay, great. What we have here is a nice oversized long sleeve corduroy oh, check the corduroy corduroy jacket button jacket it looks kind of green on camera it's definitely brown give him a nice spin there it is folks twenty dollars whoa how dizzy call now next outfit <laughs> okay this next one is Penn State New Lions go go Lions I think is what they say go Lions yep double X it's huge, it's a nice cream tone. The writing is blue with some white outline inlines. You know, a little mix up and it's very nice. It's starter, y'all know starter. Ooh, whoa, look how long your sleeves go. Sleeves are long, neck is big. So this is big a quality D. piece right here. Go Lion. Call to order, $10, $10. <laughs> All right, this next one is from Levi's folks. Levi's, this is Levi's cream toned. What kind of material? Khaki? It's like khaki material. Like if your pants were khaki, this would be the material. Really big on D, but really big on my model Delaney. <laughs> Give him a spin. It's very cute though. Nice and big. You could probably still close. wear it for sure. Yep, guys, let's give him a detail shot. Confirm the Levi's. Told you guys, Levi's. Authentic. This is $30. Call now. Canadian only. <laughs> That was our little vintage haul. If you guys like those QVC style hauls, let us know. Maybe they can, we can make do like a full on one. Make more appearances in these vlogs. So I think we're gonna start editing this vlog and I'm gonna edit some pictures and then we're gonna go to dinner. So yep. we'll show you guys dinner. Off to dinner Where in the hotel. Going? The white flower. The wild flower, here it is. Just got to the table and they have a what they call the Planet 21 initiative where all the ingredients on these items are sourced from British Columbia or parts of Alberta. So that's pretty much everything on here is sourced from Western Canada. So super cool, local and sustainable food items. The whole yeah, the whole menu is sustainable, but these items specifically are local. even local. So very cool. You excited? And our table has an epic surrounding. Snow's fallen. All right, our drinks just got here. They are virgin. We're doing virgin drinks tonight. We got this blackberry sensation and then Egyptian lemonade. How is it? First dish of the night is the vegetable pakora. It is thinly sliced vegetables and then deep fried with a little side salad. Looks really good. For the main course, we got the vegan mushroom dish. It's kind of like a steakhouse vibe. It looks really delicious. I think there's some farro down there. Maybe risotto. No, no risotto. But I'll look at all these microgreens and these little mushrooms and these are like big mushroom steaks. Looks fabulous. Alright guys, it's bedtime at the Fairmont. We got the movie theater set up and I don't know if we've told you guys yet, but we're trying to watch The Bachelor. Pretty tough. It's just this dude, this guy, that guy. Come on, dude. He can't keep his tongue in his mouth. And it's pretty much just a show about watching one dude get to know 30 girls and they, slowly... They know what The Bachelor is and slowly cut them off. It's very cringe for us, and I currently miss Bravo. 
a lot. We miss Bravo, and we also are wearing zip cream. It doesn't hit like Bravo does. It doesn't hit like Bravo. He just gave this girl a gift. He's already given gifts. He just gave yeah. her a family photo uh, with her in it. That was really weird. And now they're kissing. Yeah, see, okay. I t I'm telling you, he can't keep his tongue in it. Bro. Good morning. Yesterday and now today for breakfast, we've gotten the this oatmeal from downstairs. And it's got British Columbia blueberries in it and oatmeal and syrup. And it's delish. Delish. So De easy. Delish. Delish for Delaney. Here she is. My little skier chick. Come on, skier chick. Uh, Are you nervous? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Look at that outfit. We're on the mountain. <laughs> We're almost at the top. It's crazy up here. Dude, you're so hot. Yeah, it's much colder up here. Let's Going go. Down the big mountain. Big old mountain. It's literally huge. It's huge. It's crazy looking out here. I'm going fast. She's going fast. I'm going fast. Clayton's doing jumps, so um, that's cool. But you guys don't get to see them because I'm not. I don't know what the word is. She's not skilled, skilled enough. enough. A little sketch. Vlogging on the toilet. Riding the lift right now. Right, well, look at that. Cold. It's like a little castle. What? what? You saw a cow? Look, castle. Oh, where? Oh my god. It's like a little That's fake cool. castle thing. But yeah, this is so cool up here. Highly recommend a little Whistler flock home. What do you think? Yeah. We're in the tour bus. Taurus in the tour bus. She thinks I'm a nut case. Look at my chin. Look at my chin just popping out. We're uh, gonna go snowmobiling right now. First time. Next on the agenda is. Our guide was just telling us it's kind of hard. Yeah, it's a little hard. Got to lean. We're gonna be lean. Oh, sled. Lean in it. Oh, it's sledding. Sledding. Yeah, it's sledding. We're about to go sledding right now. We got here with Patrick. Let's go, guys. <laughs> so fun. So fun. We made it to the cabin. So they got this little cabin in the woods here. I mean, look at this. We get to have apple cider and cookies. Apple cider and cookies. Is there apple cider and cookies in there? Yeah. Oh gosh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, a little treat in the mountains. I'll go get them set them up for you. <laughs> All right. But it's absolutely beautiful out here. Having fun? Yes. Woohoo! This is our this is our ride. This is the whip. The 2020 Ski Do 600 Ace. Wow, this is so cool. All right, still getting that content for me. 30 days on posting. today's episode. On today's episode, a photo shoot in the woods. No, on today's episode of 30 Day Binge. Whole 30. Whole 30. <laughs> on today's episode of the 30 Day Instagram Binge, we're gonna shoot this Here's look in the woods. the cookies and the hot apple cider a dream come true so cute. all right patrick's putting the beginner key back in <laughs> delaney's gonna give it a go i'm, I'm gonna be passenger you're gonna be flying around the back <laughs> i'm gonna be flying now all right here we go big daddy d Oh. 
made it to our next pit stop. It's gorgeous. Patrick tells us there's mountains over there, but I don't believe him. I don't see them. It's just a snowy day. Pretty epic. All right. Well, we made it back down. <laughs> Patrick took good care of us. He did. Thank you, Patrick. Yeah, you're welcome, guys. That was pretty fun. awesome. Did you have fun? Fun, bumpy ride. I felt like I was on the real life Matterhorn. <laughs> yeah. I loved it. That is kind of what it's like. <laughs> With all the oh, snow, man. I was just waiting for the Yeti to pop out. <laughs> <laughs> Good time. Black home snowmobile. Highly recommend. Check them out. Yep, wearing that new fit though. Penn State College oh, boy. All right, but that was such a fun time. Did you have a good time? I had so much fun. Yeah, that was pretty cool. Tonight was our last night in Whistler. And we're, we got some work to do. So we're just gonna pretty much chill and uh, get a lot of work done. <laughs> Time for us to leave Whistler. <laughs> Fantastic time. It's so pretty here. I do not want to leave. Yeah. Like this view. But it was a magical time. It really was. Highly, highly recommend coming to Whistler. Yes. If you're into, well, I guess it's warm here in the summer, but in the winter, it's like a winter wonderland. Yeah. So it's picturesque. So. so what did you just do? I just got some Timmy Hortons. <laughs> Timothy who'd, Hortons. Who'd you do that for? This was for my boy, my boy Kale, Tim, Timmy H. I tried to talk to the people there and they weren't really feeling me. Yeah, he tried to. I was like, I hear it's really good. And they were like, they literally they so stared, stared at him. They are like, what do you mean? They stared at him and didn't say one word. He's like, wow. I'm I'm from America. I've never had it. <laughs> I heard it's good. Oh, okay. Wait, Bye. do you see this number here? Smell on his porch. Wow. That was funny. Yeah. This one's for you, Kale, but we just got honked at, so. Sorry. Some things never change.